How did you find out about it and what did you think about it when you found out? Twitter. <laughs> Could you believe it? What were your thoughts? I had to go check it out and see for myself. I ain't believe it when they first told me. I know you graded out at like 95%, which John Hibson said uh, that was just a little bit behind Gabe, so that, that makes me a little upset. Oh, yeah, we always in competition see who graded the highest, so to find out he graded one above me, <coughs> I, really, I really took it to heart. Was that the highest that y'all have had two guys grade out this year? Oh, yes, in one game it is. How big was that in a game like this? Uh, well, Blaine um, graded 93 too, so all three of us graded in the 90s, and all five of us grade above 85. It, it really helped out. So the, the offensive lineman grades out the highest gets more dessert. Is that right? Or is Coach Havasey pulling our chain? Uh, it, it was a lot bigger yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> dessert, dessert, it was good, but it was instead of that much, it was it was definitely. It was, it was, it was, it was, what you have? It's called a big man, so we can't tell y'all what's in it. Uh, you, when you left in the second quarter of your limping, you, I know you've talked about how you were fearing the worst, but when you went when you went on the sideline on, on the bike and everything, when, you start, when did you start feeling like, I need to get back out there? Um, I never wanted to leave, but I started, I really started to feel it like in the middle of the third quarter, and I told Coach Davis I was ready to go, so he uh, gave me to go ahead and go ahead and begin out of fourth. You know, the offense was sputtering a little bit. Was that kind of making you scratch a little bit more, wanting to get out there? A little bit, but we all season we we had that point in the game where we always sputtered a little bit. So um, in the fourth quarter we picked it up and we, we got back on track. I think